We've gone from 78 contestants to 10 to 6 extraordinary ladies. And now the judges must choose the final three in our search for the Miss New, Year, New Miss Universe. I'm getting nervous now. <laughs> ladies, I'll read these names in random order. The final three. Miss Namibia. Miss Columbia. And Miss India. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, one of these three will be the new Miss Universe. Ladies, take a deep breath now if you're ready. This is the last round of competition. This is the final question. I'll ask each of you the very same question. You'll have 20 seconds in which to respond. And to make uh, sure it's fair, I'd like you, Miss India, and Miss Columbia to go in the soundproof booth over there. We'll play a little bit of music. And you and I will step over here. Same question for everybody. Everybody in there? Okay. If you became leader of your country tomorrow, what is the first thing you would do? I would speak to the children, tell them that I'm there for them because they, they are the foundation of our every nation and I'd like them to know that I'm there for them. Thank you very much. If you would please step over here and wait a moment. <laughs> Miss Columbia. Miss Columbia, this is the same question for everyone if you'll step over here. And the question is, if you became leader of your country tomorrow, what is the first thing you would do? I guess I would orientate my people to a um, peaceful way, show them the, the right way to walk towards a, a wonderful life that is a life with peace. Thank you very much. Please step over here. <laughs> Lastly, Miss India, please. <laughs> Miss India, we've asked everyone the same question, and you will receive the same question also. If you became leader of your country tomorrow, what is the first thing you would do? I think the first thing I'll do is uh, I'll open up a big, biggest, I can say, uh, sports track and field uh, ground in India because I think we are lacking there. And that's the first thing I'll do. Very good. Thank you so much. If you'd step over here and join the others. <laughs> Ladies, you've made life very difficult for the judges. They've got a tough choice to make. They are about to cast the final vote of the evening. Now, as each contestant steps forward, the judges will give her a ranking of three, two, or one as they vote for her to be the second runner-up, the first runner-up, or the new Miss Universe. And we'll begin with Miss Namibia. is Miss Columbia. And now Miss India. Ladies and gentlemen, that completes the competition for Miss Universe 
We come to the final act of our live show from Thailand as we are about to crown the new Miss Universe. This is the moment when we have to say farewell to the young woman from Mexico who's worn the crown for the past year. Ladies and gentlemen, for the last time as Miss Universe, here is Lupita Jones. This year has been full of emotional moments for me. I will never forget the Mexican flags waving during the pageant last year. And I'm proud to be my country's first Miss Universe. I was honored to meet Mexico's President Salinas. Thank you, Mexicali, for my incredible homecoming. I tried to show the human side of the Miss Universe title with public appearances in many countries. Most important to me were the motivational talks to school children and my work with charities such as the Starla Foundation. I thank God for the opportunity of this experience, and I thank my parents for their love and support. A special thank you to Simone for sharing this year with love and respect. Next year, I welcome everyone to my country for Miss Universe 1993. Te adoro México y confío en ti. Hasta siempre. I love and trust you, Mexico, forever.